everyone. Welcome back. It's Jennifer with DP um, Addiction Adventures. So I'm just going to get real tonight. Um, what's in front of you is a current custom diamond painting I'm working on. I believe you saw it in my last video. Um, but as I was sitting here um, doing some of my diamond painting and listening to my favorite um, diamond painting YouTube people out there. Um, thank you so much. That's how I get my entertainment late at night. I love the unboxings and the tips and just the diamond painting community. Um, but also I'm sitting here wanting to get real, not just unboxing, but what in the world is going on in my world. So as I'm diamond painting, I was um, Facebook messaging my friend, Danny Ray, um, and she has ordered an abundance of diamond paintings. And because of my last video of budgeting and how in the world are people affording all of these diamond paintings, I had to do a YouTube video to laugh at myself because who it can is having an amazing sale. There's one link. It's like 69% off if you order it off of your cell phone. I think it's 68 if you order it off your laptop because they have like that extra 1% mobile um, percentage off. So I just ordered 10. I'm whispering because um, I've told my husband some of it, but not all of it. And I do not suggest hiding things from your husband. Um, he will find out about it. I just wanted him to have one more good night's sleep before I told him. But um, I ordered 10 of them for $92 total. And those are pretty big. I think the smallest one I have is a 50 by 50. Um, I have three or four 40 by 60s. 40 or 50 by 60s, um, 50 by 50s, and then I think I have one really big one, which is, well, not big, but big to me, 60 by 80. Um, so yeah, anyway, let's get to the point of this diamond painting um, YouTube video, which is what in the world do you do with the green or white alien trays? I call them alien because they are alien green. Yep, that's right. And I have this lovely box here, and tonight as I was getting ready, I'm sitting here going, oh my goodness, green tray after green tray after green tray. Every now and then you get a nice white tray, and they just pile up. So I wanted to give you kind of what I do, um, and I know this might drive people crazy because it's a little bit, um, what would you call it, daring. Um, so what I do is I have these containers, and I'll make a container video soon when I get my tripod, um, which I just ordered on Amazon. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, so these have 24 boxes in them, but most of my paintings are 32-ish um, colors. If it's over that, then I'll get another one of these and fill two up. And so I end up with usually onesie twosies colors. And what I have done is I fill up all these boxes um, and the ones that I only have ones and twos on, I put them over here on the side. And then I take ha -ha, these green alien trays. And what I do is instead of taping, I just cut the little piece out, stick it in here. And this is, um, was one, so I've been using it up. And they stack on top of each other. And so at the end of the night, I just stack them up um, and put them over here off to the side where a, a dog, a cat, a child, myself wouldn't knock them over. Um, and so I only pull them out when I need them because they're the ones that you don't use a lot of. There's only one or two bags of these drills. And so that's what I have found use for with these um, trays. And I really like using it and I've used it now for a couple diamond paintings. Um, I don't use the ones with the open, the boat with the open tip because then the diamond fall out if you accidentally turn it down. Um, 
I do at times, which I'll show you in just a second, um, because I didn't have closed tips, I do at times for ones that I have a couple bigger bags, um, may use my white trays only because I actually really like the white trays. I have a large white tray that I use, but I do like to use these from time to time. Um, they're just easier for my small hands. Oops, sorry about that. They're easier for my small hands. Um, the tip here is far enough out that usually I can catch them so that they don't fall out versus the the boats that have the cutout. Um, so yeah, that is what I do with my alien trays um, right here. So yeah, let me know what do you do with all of your extra supplies. Um, I still have to come up with what I do with all my extra, um, what do you call it, tweezers, you know, because we get a million of these cheap tweezers. And I just received my first Hua can, which I went over in my unboxing, so I'm super excited about these tweezers and I've already used them. But I have like 15 of these cheap tweezers. So what do you do? Um, you know, I'm not going to teach my kids how to pick their nose with it. Um, so I have to come up with something inventive. Or are they even recyclable? Can I just throw them in the recycling bin? Or can I donate them to Goodwill in case someone needs tweezers for free? So yeah, I came up with something to do with my trays. Um, I definitely use my wax, um, which I actually recycle and put in my, this is a version of the pick-me-up pen. So, um, you know, you can take, I'll, I'll do a video where you can take this off. A lot of people have been asking me about it, but when I get my tripod so I can have two hands. Um, but you know, so the wax after I've used it up like this, then I will ball it up and stick it in my pick-me-up pen so I get full use of the whole thing of wax. Um, so those are the two things that I do um, with the extra supplies, but I still haven't found something for the tweezers. So I'd love to hear from you. Um, shh, don't tell my husband till I tell him tomorrow after he has a good night's sleep. Um, I have 10 on the way that I just ordered. I have three that are here in the United States that are on their way. I'm hoping by the end of the week to have it. My tripod I ordered tonight from Prime, so I'll have that. Um, they said by July 20th, and so I'm really excited. And I also bought a new pen, so I'll do a pen review as well um, to join the pen review community. So have a great night, and I will chat with you later. Be blessed.